Okay, so I'm trying this carbonated clay mask. I already got it on my face, and it takes about five minutes to totally bubble up. You can see my face is getting like all frothy and stuff. This is not the same brand of mask that's been like really viral on YouTube. It's the Milky Piggy one that's viral. This one's kind of a knockoff. It's a Bio, Bio Aqua Skincare Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. It's still like a Korean beauty product, but um, yeah, so hopefully this will help. It's supposed to be a really deep cleansing mask. Um, when you open it up, it's like a really kind of like a thin jello, like gel type consistency. Um, I feel like it's dripping down on my lips and stuff. Um, so I had to get it on pretty quickly before it started bubbling and then get the lid on because if you leave the lid off, it'll start bubbling in the container. Anyway, I think I've just got a couple more minutes to go. And then you're supposed to pat it in and massage it in your skin and then rinse it off. Anyway, we'll see how big this thing gets. It's already getting pretty thick and fluffy. I don't think this one gets as thick and fluffy as the Milky Piggy one. Um, but we'll see. Hey kids, want to see my face? It's bubbly. It's a carbonated mask. It's gonna get like thicker and bubblier. Here, don't touch it. Okay, don't touch it anymore. <laughs> Do I look beautiful? Not yet, but you will. Okay. Is it not as scary as a black mask though? No, you look like a zombie face. I look like a zombie face? Yeah, yeah your face looks like a zombie. See? Am I a pretty zombie? Yeah, but... A mommy zombie? Yeah. <laughs> Is it weird? Yeah, I feel weird! <laughs> how did this happen? It's carbonated. But how do you carb it? I don't know. Okay, so it's been five minutes. And now you're supposed to... Like, massage on your face. It just feels like I have, like, soapy lather on my face because I can feel like the bubbles popping or whatever. Not really, especially tingly or whatever. It smells good, but anyway, so it's like massage it in your face and goes back to its muddy state. And then, you know, obviously I'm gonna have to like wash my face and like rinse it off or whatever. It's really thick though, it almost feels like a lotion. So I don't think it's something that's going to rinse off like Super quick, you're gonna have to work at it a bit. Anyway, oh, it's getting cool popping the bubbles. But yeah, the carbonation's fun for effect, but hopefully it helps my skin and actually does something beyond just regular face washing. Whew. Wow, that's weird. Okay. I guess I will give a final report after I'm done with this and get it off my face. Okay, so final verdict on the mask. I've got it all washed off now. Um, you know, my face feels, feels clean. It feels, you know, moisturized and soft. Does it feel any more deep clean than, like, using my normal like cleanser, which I did wash my face before this, but does it feel any deeper clean like it's supposed to? I don't know, and honestly, maybe part of it's that I didn't use the same brand that a lot of people have used that I've seen. Maybe the Milky Piggy version, um, maybe that works a little bit better. That's sold by like a different company or whatever. Um, I personally prefer how my face feels after like the black peel off mask. This one isn't a peel mask so it doesn't really exfoliate as much although I do think it did clean out some of my nose pores that you know are a little bit tougher to get to on me and then you know I'm just broke out in general right now but I guess we'll see over the next um, a couple uses to see if it has any effect on my acne or whatever. My skin doesn't really feel irritated or anything right now, though, so that's good. Anyway, um, my recommendation would probably be to try the Milky 
piggy one first the carbonated clay mask or whatever if you google it you'll find it it's a little bit cheaper and I think it gets a little foamier than this one like a little thicker and I've heard better reviews on it but um you know it's not bad and my face isn't like falling off so that's always good all right